Hi, this is Nudia and Cynthia, and I would like to ask a question. Am I the sex goddess of the universe, or what? Uh, no. I am not. I am not the sex goddess of the universe. I'm just an older, I'm not old yet, getting there, but I'm not there yet. Older woman, baby boomer. I was wild when I was younger. My friends, my family know this. My mother would never let me forget that I used to be a hippie. Okay, now, I write songs that are full of passion, sometimes a little risque. Not vulgar, but a little bit risque. And it talks about love. And yeah, it talks about doing it. Sort of. But they're pretty little love songs. And the reason partly is men and boys have no clue about what to do with a young woman or woman. They have no idea. You know, and, and the thing is, is some of my songs are to educate. They're not to get men excited. Is this a face to get men excited? Is this flabby old body? Something to get men excited. No. If you are getting excited by me, I probably wouldn't be interested in you. No offense. However, truth is, I do know what women need. Not necessarily what they think they want, okay? Because most women nowadays, not so much women my generation, but women of the younger generations, it's like, whatever he wants me to do, I'm going to do it because I want him to love me. He doesn't love you. He's using you. You're like a piece of toilet paper he wipes his butt on. I mean, let's get serious. He's going to watch some little porn video, and then he's going to come back to you and say, Oh, if you love me, why don't you show me how much? And I can beat the crap out of you, and I can use whips and chains, and use every orifice that you have, and some you didn't know you had. And then, even though you're in pain, or it's something that is, like, really, really disgusting to do, and you're thinking, oh, he loves me. He doesn't love you, okay? So here I am, and I'm writing my little songs, and sometimes my poetry, and I'm talking about how... Women like it when men are very gentle with them. They like a tender touch. Ooh. Women like it when a man make them purr like they're a cat. Meow. Meow. Mm, yes. And they like little bit, itty bitty kisses. Mm, 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 mm. Yes, they do. Now, if you're a female and you think, oh, I don't know if I like that. Trust me. Try it. Instead of having him, you know, instead of going along with his porn videos or even some of these, you know, stupid female romances that it's like, oh, he wants me to do this. I'm going to do this because I really love him and he's cute. Blah, 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 blah. No, 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 no. What you do is you have to train them and you have to get them away from the porn sites and you need to get away from the porn sites. And what you do is you just little itty bitty kisses all over you. That's what you need. And you need very tender touch. And, you know, spend like, oh, I don't know, an hour or two on foreplay. Um, and foreplay, by the way, means little itty bitty kisses, little, little cuddles, little cuddles, Ooh, nice little hugs. Yeah. Am I the sex goddess of the universe or what? Maybe. Maybe. Okay, no. But I just thought I'd let you know about that. So when I sing my songs about passion, it's to educate. It's to say to women, and it's to say to men, women need gentleness. A woman needs to be cherished. She needs to be caressed. She doesn't need to be treated like she's a piece of crap that's on the bottom of your shoe. She needs to be touched gently. That's what that's what's needed here. So try it. 
and just say that the sex goddess of the universe sent you and told you what to do. This is Nuri Hatsynthia, bringing you more wonderful words of wisdom.